son of a- What's up, I'm Rob. You're watching Hack Job, not Hand Job. Apparently there's been some confusion. You fucking perverts, get off my lawn. Oh, hey, there's a cat. What up, cat? Psst. All right. Summertime is here, which means that it is fucking hot as piss outside. And that means that it's time to watermelon some shit up. Now, I know, I know there's a ton of watermelon hacks out there. They've all been done before. I don't give a shit if you've seen them or not. I'm gonna fucking try them today. It's hot. I need some watermelon. The idea came about because I was going to the store and they were having a sale on seedless watermelons. Seedless! That's the worst part about a watermelon are the fucking seeds. I can't stand it. You can't like enjoy it, you know? You can't like take a mouthful and just be like, ah! What a time to be living in where watermelons can be fucking seedless. Kitty, what do you think? Seedless watermelons. Where are you going? Hey, seedless watermelons. Hey. Okay. All right, for the first hack, I'm making this tequila watermelon, which looks delicious as fuck. I actually started this one a couple days ago because it needs a few days to absorb the alcohol. Uh, I just carved out a hole, popped the bottle in, and set it in the fridge for a couple days, which was a couple days ago, which means that it's ready. All right, fresh out of the fridge after nearly three days, we have our drunk watermelon. It looks like it took on at least three quarters of the bottle, which is more than I expected for such a small watermelon, but fuck yeah. I carefully removed the bottle from the top and then just cut that shit up. Oh yeah, this is the stuff dreams are made of. Look at that, that is juicy. This is a fucking remarkable idea. Whoever came up with the first iteration of the drunk watermelon is genius. All right, so then you just take your salt and I guess you just like, Dip it in there, right? Look at this. Fuck yeah, that is gonna be delicious. Ooh. <laughs> All right. Oh god, that is terrible. Really? Fuck! I have real fucking high hopes for this. Woo! It's a lot of, a lot of tequila. Holy shit! I don't know what the. Just happened. Second bite, a lot better than the first one. I think now that I'm like actually acclimated to it, it kind of tastes good. Woo! Shit, that is amazing. Ooh, this is kind of life changing. Where have you been all my life? Mmm, this is good. All right, we're doing fucking awesome here. Next hack, watermelon cake. This one I had to do immediately because I love fucking cake, but watermelon cake. Uh, I don't know about that one. I picked out one of the rounder watermelons since uh, a cake is primarily circular in nature. Oh, God damn it. Ugh. Next fucking step. I started skinning the rind off of the watermelon only to realize uh, obviously that this one wasn't ripe enough yet. You'll know right away once they start screaming. It's a little annoying. Uh, but they usually die shortly afterwards or somewhere in the middle of the process. Is that even funny? And then, to the best of my ability, I carved it into a solid circle. Uh, close enough. Close of enough. Whoa, 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 whoa! What the fuck are these? Are these fucking seeds? In my fucking seedless watermelon? What the fuck is happening here? Hold on, I'm checking the fucking stick. The fucking sticker says that, that this is a goddamn seedless grown watermelon. What fucking kind of bullshit is that? There's fucking seeds all up in this fucking thing. This is some false advertisement bullshit. Whatever, nothing I can do now. Now, next step was to bust out the cool whip. What'd you say? What? You're saying it weird. Why are you putting so much emphasis on the H? You know what, now that I think about it, this may very well be the first time that I've ever frosted a cake before, which is probably why it's turning out like fucking shit. But the Cool Whip is just sliding off because it's a fucking watermelon. It's slippery and everything's fucking slipping and sliding all over the goddamn place. It's a fucking mess. This shit is not working. The only method I found that worked was just put all of the fucking Cool Whip on it till it just covers the whole fucking cake. This frosting, I thought at the time, when I bought it in the store would be a good idea, uh, but I realized that again, I have never really decorated the cake before, so this was, this was the icing on the cake that fucking made this thing look like shit. Sprinkles, however, you throw fucking sprinkles on anything and that just fucking livens up the goddamn party. Now it looks fucking awesome. Look at that fucking cake. Throw some berries on it. Boom. Watermelon cake. Let's fucking test that shit out. There it is. Watermelon cake. Yeah, it's a goddamn winner. That is fucking delicious. <laughs> this is fucking. This is good. Mm. I saw this next one on BuzzFeed and it looked amazing. Definitely appealed to my ninja-like skills. It's where you take a quarter and you run it along the rind of the watermelon and then you karate chop the shit out of it. So I grabbed a quarter, I cut a small slit in the melon and slowly proceeded to put... Oh, I lost the fucking quarter. Oh, f 
Get in and make it even fucking an inch. Uh, uh, what the fuck? Come on, now I gotta get a fucking tool now? Great, I gotta get some fucking pliers. Hold on. All right, I'm just carefully pushing the quarter through the rind. It's easier in some places, but then, then it just starts getting real fucking hard. It starts to fucking hurt. Ah, God damn it. Ah! Just keep on going. Ah, are you fucking serious? Oh, I've got so much more watermelon to go. Fuck! Ah, this is not fucking easy. Uh, just go a little bit further. Just keep on pushing through. Ah, got it. Shit. Ah, uh, we got it. We fucking made it. Holy shit. All right, time to fucking karate chop this fucking thing already. All right, here we go. One, two. Ah! <laughs> okay, fucking gotta do it harder than that, I guess. One, two. Yeah! Got it! Fucking got it! I'm the fucking goddamn fucking karate kid over here! Alright, alright. Now with this finely chopped watermelon, we're moving on to our next hack, grilled watermelon. Now, off the top of my head, it, this sounds fucking pretty good. Like, you're taking the watermelon, you're hitting it with some fire, you know, giving it some char, you're burning a little bit of those sugar crystals on, making like a creme brulee. I don't fucking know, but this could be fucking delicious. And whoa, 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 wait, what the fuck? is this? More goddamn seeds? You gotta be fucking kidding me. Come on. How do they get away with this? How are these watermelon farmers even sleeping at night? This is a goddamn conspiracy. I carved out some of the bigger slices and threw them on the grill. They smell pretty fucking awesome as soon as they make contact. There's some sizzling action going on here. Oh yeah. Check that shit out. Flip these fucking things over. Look at those grill marks. All right. I think that they're ready. Here we go. Grilled watermelon. Oh yeah. Look at that. Huh? Look at that. That fucking barbecue watermelon bullshit. Ah! 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 Mm hmm Duh. It's fucking hot. Burnt my fucking tongue. You fucking son of a bitch. Can't fucking taste anything now. This is fucking stupid. Hot fucking watermelon. Who the, the f wants hot goddamn watermelon? Fuck this. On to the last hack, which I'm not even sure technically if it's a hack or not, but a lot of you have been suggesting it. It is the watermelon brain sculpture thing. I got a couple of my old pumpkin carving supplies and then this potato peeler, which I think is going to work to take the skin off. Yeah, I guess you could say that this is, uh, this is working. Now once you have the skin off, uh, I just went online and followed this picture. And with these pumpkin carving tools, it was actually pretty fucking easy. This is actually looking pretty fucking awesome. Not doing a bad job over here. That is for goddamn sure. Who the fuck saw that one coming? This is looking like a brain. This is pretty cool. All right, there it is. The fucking watermelon brain. Fucking good on ya. Jesus. I'm impressed with myself. But at this point, I guess there's only one last thing to do with it. This. This is your brain. This is your brain on Threadbanger. Any fucking questions? Where's that fucking tequila watermelon? There you are. Mm. Oh god, I, I forgot how strong that was. You gotta fucking try some of this. Only if you're 21. Oh yeah. Ow. Woo! Hack job! Well, I'm out of watermelons and fucks to give, which means we have reached the end of this episode. Seen some hacks that I need to do on the show? Let me know about them in the comments below. That's what those are there for. Subscribe. Help us reach 3 million subscribers. Or don't. Whatever. You don't have to be a fucking dick about it. Follow me over on Instagram where I just flip things off randomly. Uh, and I will see you around here next time.